Good morning, beautifuls! <laughs> I just cleaned up the mirror here in the walkway. <laughs> Let's go outside. Hi! Good morning. It's Monday, May 20th. It's 10.30 in the morning. And it apparently is like 14 degrees out here. Um, okay. It's actually not cold, but there is a breeze, so it doesn't make it warm, if you know what I mean. Should come out and do some yard work today. Everybody else in the neighborhood is doing yard work. Nope, not me. You know what I did? I did spell work. We're coming off a of full moon, so I did a reflective spell, and I will have that edited and up in the next couple of days. I am so excited, though. I am... Oh, shoot. I forgot the water. I am so excited, so excited, so excited. I... I've been catching a whole ton of birds in here drinking water. A couple of them sitting on the edge here drinking water. A couple of hummingbirds, three different ones coming in. I'm so excited. And then also, today is bingo day. That's exciting. Why is that exciting? It is my son and future daughter-in-law's wedding fundraiser. So they're hosting a merchandise bingo. And out here in Manitoba, they do things differently when it comes to weddings and stuff. Like, they do socials, and I've never been to a social. It's where you have a bar and a venue, and people come, and you have a good time. And so, yeah, there's that. <laughs> um, but, yeah, we get to go up and meet part of the family. She's really smart. She's like, can you guys come up and work? Um, which, really, we don't mind helping out at all. Uh, she's like, because then that way the families can get to know each other before the wedding and it's not weird. Okay, well, Kai's family is very small. I mean, Fuzzy's family is very small. So, yeah, this totally works for us. We've met Mom a couple of times and she's super awesome. So, yeah, I think we've met Dad. Have we met the Dad? I'm not sure. So, yeah, that's that's the thing right now. We're going to do uh, merchandise bingo tonight. And I've, um, I'm donating three of my dream catchers for the kids so that they can give them away. They haven't sold at the community center, so might as well get the new stock in there. Oh, so pretty. I'm so excited. Um, so, yeah, I was just out here casting spells. And... Um, my moment of gratitude today, that's right, that's what I'm doing right now is vlogging. My moment of gratitude today is my audacity. It, sometimes I come across as really cocky, uh, overconfident, um, or like, you know, I do things where people look at me and like, how dare you? And I dare. Because it's me. And if I'm doing something that feels right, I don't care about the judginess that comes with it. Um, so yeah, two of my neighbors just caught me spelling. I don't really think one of them was paying too much attention, but I got dirty looks from the other one, which I really don't care. Um, doing what makes me happy. So sometimes we have to go against what society feels that we should be doing and pave the road for ourselves. Um, so yeah, I, I have really interesting stories about witchcraft and things that I've been through. And um, being able to share basics with people, it just, it, it scares me actually, um, <laughs> because of some of the things that happened. But all that aside, it is an honor and a pleasure to be able to share my knowledge with people. And I am very grateful for that. I am oh, not grateful for my garbage. I haven't cleaned up yet. And it is not beautiful, so let's not talk about it. Um, I love teaching. I learn well, and I learn fast. And I can break things down and explain them to people well also. Um, oh, oh man, I hope my finger wasn't on that the whole time. Look at these beautiful dandelions. I'm sure that's also what my neighbors are cursing me out about right now. But I love dandelions. And I'm going to go feed some to my chickens. You want to come? Let's go feed some to the chickens. Don't yell at me about picking dandelions. There are plenty. See? We didn't pick them when they first came up. We left them. 
And there's been crocuses, and yeah, I'm not justifying myself in picking dandelions for my chickens. <laughs> they were all bock, bock, bocking at me, and I already gave them greens, so like, what more do you want from me, ladies? So yes, I am grateful to have uh, my religious freedom and to be able to share that education with people, that knowledge. Hold on. Let's go feed the chickens. These beautiful, beautiful dandelions. Hello, chickens. Good morning, chickens. Betty likes to hang out on top of the compost, which is really funny. I love these ladies. These ladies give me... Hey, hey, back it up, girls. Don't charge at me. Hold on, I gotta lock the door. Do you want this? Look at them. They're like, oh, give me some, give me some. What do you want? Betty, what you doing up there, girl? Here. You're going to have to come down and get some. Is she he hears us outside, like right there? She'll jump up there and yell at us. Come on down and get some. Come on, girl. Bunty, you just buried the whole lot of it. <laughs> Are you coming down? You're a pretty girl. Am I on your way? Am I on your way, pretty girl? Bunty just scratched it all behind her and she's hiding it now. What a jerk. <laughs> Patches is taken off with it. Are you going down to have some? Or are you just going to watch what the girls are doing? Look. Look, you want some of that? Are you coming down to get it? Are you going to get it? Are you going to get it, you crazy chicken? Go get it. Go on. Go on. Oh, that's a big fly there, Betty. Good job. So here they are, pack, pack, packing. There you go, girls. Enjoy. Don't eat it all like that, Patches. All right, I'm out. Got two brown eggs from the ladies today. Oh, there we go. Those girls give me reason to get up and get dressed on some mornings. And uh, I'm grateful for that. I need them. I need a pet. I'm missing my dog. But I have chickens. So yeah, they they have done me very well. And I love them. I love you too. Oh, let's go look out the field before I say good good day for the day. Shall we? Shall we go and look at the field? <laughs> There is a big fire from the farmers. The farmers burn ooh, a lot around here. And uh, the other day I posted on Instagram, it was like right in there and huge billows of smoke were going across. And I understand they do it, but I will raise holy hell if they try burning this field behind our houses because that's just shit. Um, <laughs> so I'm glad to see there's nothing smoldering. Everything's out. That hill this year is a lot hillier than it has been in the past. So that's that. And I think this is where I'm going to leave it. I'm going to go and edit this video. I hope you guys have a great day. And thank you so much for hanging out here with me celebrating the beauty. I love you guys. And I hope your day is great. And I will see you again tomorrow when we vlog. Bye! Mwah!